McDavid to Maroon. Maroon back up top here. Tuck by shot. He scores. The conclusion to Edmonton's five-game homestand is a matinee matchup with the 6-7-1 Detroit Red Wings. The Oilers will try to build off what was a solid 6-3 victory over New Jersey. It, uh, it takes a little bit of the pressure off for one night. Um, obviously, uh, it doesn't allow us to completely crawl back into where we want to be in the standings, but it's, uh, it's the first step. And what it does is it allows us to, uh, to try and build. And if we do things right and we play the game the right way, uh, throughout the lineup, we have a chance to win. We had some good zone time. Uh, we, we got pucks to the net. We played fast. Uh, we were physical. Um, yeah, that's that's a fair statement to say that uh, if we want to win hockey games, we have to start playing like that more often. I think at this point we're all professionals. We play play enough uh, afternoon games to to find out how we have to figure out our schedule tomorrow to adjust. Um, they're always fun. I think you, the, the good thing about uh, afternoon games, you're not waiting around all day for the game. Uh, you kind of wake up, uh, get yourself ready, get to the rink, and uh, game on. It's worth noting that Anton Slepyshev was injured late in the game on Friday night. Todd McClellan saying the winger is doubtful against the Wings. All time, the Oilers have a 52, 72, and 6 record with nine ties in afternoon games and are 12, 15, and 1 with two ties on home ice in matinee matchups. Tom Gazzola, Oilers TV.